Welcome to This Is Important, a production of iHeartRadio, the show where we only talk about what's obviously most crucially integral to the fabric of our very nature. Today we talk about... Uh, I jerked off in a TJ Maxx once. God, isn't that crazy? You make it to the toilet and you still piss your pants? No, sometimes I just push too hard to fart and then, you know, some stuff comes out. We're gonna ride the cum slide the whole way, baby. Here we go. This is important. Hell yeah, it is. Yeah, baby. You know this. I'm hella amped. Uh, Blake, did you masturbate on a uh, flight when you were a kid watching uh, watching What's some up? movie? What? What? Where is this coming from? Why? I heard. You? I heard a little clip of. What is this gotcha? What is this gotcha journalism? This is gotcha right journalism. Out the gate? Yeah. Jesus. Well, no, you said it on another podcast. I'm wondering why you're telling cool stories about masturbating on planes on other podcasts, and you're not mentioning it on our podcast when that's obviously a cool story to tell. Well, uh, first off, I will shout out. Yeah, but still a very friend of the pod, at least from this tr square of the circle. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah. I told that story on their podcast because we didn't have a podcast yet. Is well, what real? is their what is their podcast? You got to call them out. Yeah, but still, is the podcast? Oh yeah, but still. Oh, I thought you were just I thought you were just saying a phrase. Yeah, Jack Wagner, Brandon Wardell. Yeah, big shout out to uh, no. the pod. Okay, so you want to you want to give us that story over here, or is it it's, you you've already well now I feel it. like they should go over to that pod and check it out there. But did, did you I, just hit the friendship button for them or for us? Yeah, what was that uh, for all of the us? The fuck is happening? No, 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 no. This is a friendship family. Why am I? But I'm feeling very interrogated right now. Well, yeah, now. he jumped out the gate. He interrogated you. I didn't mean to. I just I literally. It uh, seems like you did. Yeah, well, you, I you, you came out I didn't hot, to, and I well, support you, but okay, you came out hot. Isn't, I wasn't oh, trying to now. get at my guy. I was just wondering. I just heard it. It was like five minutes ago. I heard this little clip of Blake telling this funny story, and I'm like, why well, he never told this story? I feel like we've been telling jerk-off stories, J.O. Yeah. stories all the time on this podcast. Yeah, We're always true. telling some epic tales, and yeah. Blake had just left this one in the cut when I feel like this one's prime for... This is important. Yeah. This is you important. lose. Oh, buddy. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> fucking no. The double no, diss. I, you know, it came very organically in that podcast. It wasn't like I was just like chomping at the bit to tell the, about the time that I J-O'd on an airplane mm -hmm. in my youth. This is okay. pre. How this old are you? Come. Let's dive in. <laughs> this is pre pre. Yes. This is pre pre. <laughs> What's pre pre? Just the air? The air shots? Yeah. When you used to just kind of. <coughs> And that was oh, it. By yeah. the way, I feel like a lot of women, uh, a lot of females don't know that that was a thing. Like I told Chloe, I was telling some story uh, a few weeks ago and I tell Chloe this, she's like, what do you mean nothing came out? And I'm like, yeah, before oh, yeah. you hit puberty, it doesn't come out. And I was right. a little late hitting puberty. Right. I was like kind of the smaller kid. And so, the so there was, I was like, bummed when it started to happen. I'm like, I gotta clean this up every time now. Right. Yeah. There right. used to be no evidence. Now all of a sudden, there's evidence everywhere. There's so that, much evidence. There's well, so well, much well, evidence. Remember when it first starts, it's just like one clear teardrop. And it's, oh, really? That's yeah, how you well, saw for it? Me, yeah. yeah, it was like, a, it was like <laughs> my dick cried one tear huh. of joy. Of you joy. are bringing back specific memories? This is so weird. Durs, you didn't, you didn't do one single teardrop, or you just started one day, the faucet turned on, and you were no, just like... I, I just said you brought back like a very specific memory from me of that exact thing. Oh, you had... So you, you do remember when you just had... I didn't first. remember until just now, and I'm like, oh, yeah. yeah. It was like, yeah, yeah. I think it was only pre, right? I think that was just what it was. It wasn't like a... It wasn't a load. This is important. I don't know if there was a load. I think it was just like pre. <laughs> <laughs> I do remember this, too. I'm I'm thinking back. Were we the there together, first Kyle? initial. <laughs> I remember yours. Wait, yes. yeah. I, were we, were we I, looking I, at the same moon, Kyle? Same I moon, Anders. You know I do believe... That mine w went from like just only pre mm -hmm. to a, a a real just fucking wham bam thank you ma'am. I think it's the it's the clear it's clear and it's yeah it's because it's, the consistency you know come on man you've tasted your I mean you've seen your yeah <laughs> but I mean like at that time was the pre coming at the end or what what I remember it coming at the end I think it was just a tiny load. So you know what the prefix pre means right? Yes, that means before. Yes. before? Right. Yeah, but mm -hmm. what does pre stand for? 
It's probably Latin or some premature. shit. Premature? Yeah. Premature. <laughs> yeah, you figured it out. And that was a test, Kyle. Yes. <laughs> premature. And the smartest box in the, in the square. <laughs> what? A little wait, premature, what do you, man. Wait, what do you think he just c- came up with? Premature. No, premature. no. Several words have pre, pre is a pre- preemptive. Is a prefix. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. Hey, maybe it's prefix. Maybe that's you think the origin. Pre- <laughs> <laughs> what? It's definitely not pre- premature. Is when you jizz before you thought you wanted to. So then, well, sure. for sure, like you couldn't, like you couldn't control it. Sure, right. sure, sure. Premature pre- ejaculation. What is the? Yeah, I was, I was wondering what, what before pre- you really come. That's yes. what pre come is. So it's premature come. No, no. no. What premature the fuck? ejaculation is like when you bust too quick. Right. That's like premature he- ejaculation, but. Ejaculation is like a verb, right? That's an action word. Pre-come is a noun, so it's no. premature come. So what's pre-coming, mm-hmm. Kyle? Ugh. Pre- yes, that'd be the same as like I ejaculation. Got, hey, I got hey, a noun. see, guys, why do you think I come out the gate so hot? Because then we start off like a fucking firecracker. Now Fourth of like, July's yeah. coming up. Hey, we're just wait. Like, dogs chasing our own pre-come tails here. So what are you saying that pre-come? It's the stuff that comes before the come. Right. Yes. Mm-hmm. Prematurely. Premature. H- hang on but a second. My boys are here. That's not premature ejaculation. Hang on, my kids just walked in. Hang on. What do you need? Yeah. <laughs> now I don't you care. Know. Just now uh, you know. just don't eat it. Okay. Anyway, go ahead. They had a sword. You heard it from your uncles. Now you know. All right. Cats out of the bag. That's what pre cum is. Okay. Now shut up about it. That's cool. Pre cum is just pre. That's it's important. Cum. But uh, yeah, is it I, saying a preposition I, previous to before? Hmm. Right. Previous. So yeah. Hmm. Oh, previous come. Seems real. <laughs> previous on come. Previously like, on come. <laughs> like it, it's 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 just something that goes at the beginning of a word that means previous. Like how uh, like un at the beginning of a word like is that so it's the opposite like unlocked. Oh my means god. It's not how locked. did words even start though? Thank you. Adam. Hey, let's get what? into it. Thank yeah, you. let's really unpack. I feel like we're the guys. Dude, here's here's I want to rewind a second to when mm-hmm. Blake was jerking off on this airplane. Mm-hmm. Um, okay. <laughs> Who are you what? with by the way? Yeah, how old were you? Let's I want to I want some details here. Maybe you don't want to tell the whole story. Maybe we're only going to get part of the story, but I Well, I, what's wild? I think I it's j- important. I just got done texting my dad about how he uh, listens to the the podcast while he does his uh, his biking, and I'm uh-huh. like, okay, Cycling? well, the He's way a this as well. <laughs> the way uh, this came about is I used to um, because I came from a divorce home, but I still would go in between well, why don't you my, cry about it? my mother and father's <laughs> house. <laughs> you lose, but. <laughs> I would take a plane to see my dad because he lived in Southern California. So I was an unintended minor on planes quite a bit. I so how old that. were you when you started jerking off on planes? Well, regularly. so this is what I was talking about on Yeah, But yeah, but Still is we were talking about how like Game Pro magazines, there was a time when like Tomb Raider was the hot shit and like, mm-hmm. like <laughs> virtual titties were like- Lara Croft. Yeah, they were all up in the building. So I'd be yeah, flipping yeah. through the Game Pro mm. and I'd see like, Dead or Alive Volleyball, which was like this... DOA? <laughs> yeah, where it was just like fake video game titties, but mm-hmm. it got my young... I remember that. ...dick on swole, boy. Okay. So, oh, once again, yes. how old... So it was last year. <laughs> <laughs> We're just like... I know. I'm trying to get any information. You're telling all the shit no, that we're not asking. Wh- let's look. I, I like it, it, Blake. I like your story, Blake. I, I like it, it too. I'm just saying he's being cagey with the details. Mm-hmm. I would probably say it was in junior high, right? That's probably when Tomb Raider was firing and I wasn't, you know, I was still shooting blanks. Like I wonder if some... we can find out exactly what flight it was because there's like records of this, right? You were shooting blanks in junior high, bro? Oh, my God. Mm, you know that blown, about me. Up. I was full blown loading. I was a late bloomer, guys. <laughs> cool. Big time late. Sorry. Hey, question. What? So I actually, I think like the hentai titties are pretty cool. But mm-hmm. why is it that every hentai mm-hmm. video, the like super hot chicks with the giant titties, also have like a monster hog cock? What is yeah, that? So what I, is? There's not just one straight up. I don't, up know, I don't sex. know hentai very well. I apologize. I, I'm also not in that world. It's like the CGI porno, where you're like. You click on it and you go, oh, this, this could be cool. And you're like, whoa, look how good the graphics have come. It's pretty hot. And Kyle. then it's just a giant veiny hog on a, on a woman. And you're like, 
it's not really my thing. Is there any? Yeah, well, it's some people's thing, okay? Don't right. kink but shame, But it's okay? all of it. I'm saying, is there a little something for the freaks like me that's still like it natch? Well, have you looked up hentai woman no dick? That's too much. I don't want to get, I don't want to start Googling Then you're it. in the weeds. Then well, you're a hentai guy, okay? You don't want to be a hentai right, guy. I don't want to be a hentai guy. And no, no offense to the hentai Maybe guy. Maybe try Googling specifically what you'd like, you know? I, I know, but like, then I'm like seeking He's an out. accidental. He's like, a, oh, oops, oops. Yes, this thank video, you, Adam. how did this come into the queue? I'm not a familiar. Sure, I get that. The rabbit yeah. hole. I get You're ripping on the terror. What is this uh, demon fucking a woman here? Yes, oh, right. click this on is that. What, th here's what I'll say about any animated pornography. It gets weird quick. It's right. like a portal to bizarre stuff. You right. know, no kink shaming, but it gets it gets weird. It has a dark well, we side to kink it as shame, well. Yeah, right. we can kink shame also, some just, stuff because some stuff is, you know, fucking a bizarre world. Saying mm -hmm. it's bizarre doesn't necessarily mean it's shameful. It's just saying it is mm. bizarre. Mm. Right? Mm. I think we can agree mm. that. Mm. Well, let's bizarre. dissect the word mm. bizarre yes. with the root word by. <laughs> okay. So that means two. Uh, Zar. Pre bizarre. A czar was a <laughs> king or a, a sultan in, in uh, mid century <laughs> Russia, mm -hmm. right? right, right. How old something? were you when you jerked off on flights? <laughs> we won a number. <laughs> I don't so, have a pinpoint date. I will try to find the game pro and that got me going. Well, will, will you tell us about um, the, the plane? The experience. The <laughs> equipment, as they call it? Was it a nighttime flight? Was this midday? Yeah. Were you going there in the middle of the morning? Tell me you, about who like, the you seat situation. Yeah, Is this like a one seat on the other side and two on the other? Because you're just flying from LA, from it's what a, it's airport a, to what? It's a 45 minute flight. And what kind of pants are you? Rock and sweatpants? Are these sweatpants? This is middle school. You're unaccompanied. Who were you sitting next to? I, there's details that are foggy, but it I, it was not a night flight. It was like an afternoon flight. You afternoon wow. flight. <laughs> and, an the, afternoon and there flight. was a gentleman sitting next to me, but he was sleeping. He was sleeping. <laughs> Wait, and oh, I wow. Had, <laughs> A you sleep attack? Sleeping. There was a gentleman sleeping next to you. I know, I know for damn certain you guys must have had an instant in your teenage horniest years that you J-O'd a time or place that was inappropriate or yeah. you just should have kept it sure. like, on. We're not talking about us. It's, it's in the hundreds, <laughs> if not <laughs> thousands, <laughs> but we're talking about you right now. We didn't go on another podcast to talk about it. Okay? Correct. Yeah. Is, See, we bring our dirty, our dirty stories to this podcast. Mm -hmm. It Me? was pre. This is important. So, and what does that mean? Before? Yes, it was before. Oh, cool. We Thank had. you. It's not premature. Thank you. <laughs> so you were prematurely. <laughs> I was prematurely spilling my jo beans on another. Wait. Podcast. So this is so this is but this is pre pre cum. Or this yes. is pre okay. So you just did an air pop on an airplane. <laughs> I did an air pop on an airplane pre air pods. So we know that's the f time frame. Well, that's the best time to do something like that when you're. That's dry when popping. you can yeah. get away with it. Tell your kids. You don't have to clean. Well, up let's not let's not phrase it like that's when you can get away with it. No, this is what I'm going to tell it my is, kids. Though. It is, yeah, and that's why we are living in a worse time. Where right. now children, when they're alone and they're just in their horny estate and they're mm -hmm. just, they're, they're jiggling on the flight a little bit and just the bounce is, is making their balls Turbulence. just kind of, just yeah, kind of, right. just and the off, air the, off the, the seat and the air pressure is kind of mm -hmm. fucking them up. Mm -hmm. And yeah. you know, the, there's a stewardess there and she's a living woman. So that's crazy. She's a walking, talking uh, woman. And then there's a guy who's asleep next to you. Mm -hmm. is, is that Gentleman a weird thing snoring. that turns you on for he's, no reason? That forearm hair he's got. Maybe you're watching Space Jam, Lola Bunny. But nowadays, <laughs> everyone has a goddamn video camera in their pocket called a cell phone. And yep. the kids are not safe to jerk off anymore. Right. Because what was the bad, worst thing that was going to happen in the, dare I say, best decade? Blakey, the 90s, mm -hmm. the worst thing that was going to happen is that guy's going to wake up and just see little froey Blake just all froed out, just mm -hmm. yanking his meat stick. Right. You know, and a that's big the worst. Fucking boner right and, now. And, and that would be a weird encounter. You'd land. We'd have a laugh about it. The guy next to you definitely just gives you a nod. He's like, been there. This is also pre 9 11, so this he'd see important. my father as soon as we got off the flight and he'd be like, right. dude, your son. 
he's a, I caught him looking at Lara Croft. He's all right, all right. <laughs> they all chest bump. <laughs> he's like all he right. Yeah, yeah, he's all right, all right, all right, all right. I just uh, I, cartoon I, women. Uh, I guess he's all right. I wish the stewardess came by and was like, said something like. Is that your peanuts? And you thought you said penis and you like really freaked out, but your peanuts were like on the ground. Uh, well, you know, that's the greatest Ace Ventura bit ever where she's well, like, sure. Peanuts. She's well, like, can't, don't you have it? Or he's like, it's kind of hefty, but I consider it a carry on. Don't you have yeah, it? Yeah, I do have it somewhere. It's bulky, but I consider it a carry on. Yeah, you'd it's want bulky, her to be but like, I consider it carry on. Right. Boom. Like, like she's taking your trash and she's like, can I grab your nuts? And you're like, excuse me. And you're like the yeah the rapper. And you're Cup like, your nuts? Uh, yeah. The yeah. rapper? Which rapper? Yeah, of course. Do you mind if I lick your nuts? Um, <laughs> what? Well, if you're not you, gonna eat them, uh, I love licking this the salt off them. I don't want. Do the you calories. mind if I uh, suck your cock? <laughs> what? <laughs> idea, 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 idea. I, I mean, oh, you're I was talking to the nuts. farmer oh. behind you. <laughs> Yeah. That's what you wish. It, yeah, I mean, when you're a teenage boy, all you're thinking about is the possible porno situation that could happen. Teenage 20s, too. Also, also when you're in your 20s, too, right? I mean, that doesn't stop. That's true. Sometimes I have drive through interactions. Where Kyle's like, over there like, I'm not dead yet. Yeah, I mean, you're allowed to have I'm still a red-blooded <laughs> American man. Mm. Okay, yeah. I'm allowed to imagine things, all right? Will you right. take away my imagination? Huh? I, I mm -hmm. never will. I already took away his president. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. Man, we're so Thank you, God. You know what's crazy? Fucking we're so politically sucks. charged, guys. I oh, keep thinking about how charged about we are politically. Okay. Oh, my gosh. It's mm. incredible. Uh, like, just, it's what drives mm. us. Dude, mm. let's talk about it. R Ross yeah. Perot, where do we stand? Can I finish? Bro, can I finish? Can I finish? Can I finish? Can I finish? We got to get that. I want to get a lizard named Newt Gingrich. What else is funny and just okay. political? Uh, yes, uh, Newt Gingrich. Oh, so the Newt, Newt Gingrich who stole what Christmas. Else? Ooh, the Newt Gingrich who stole the Gingrich. election. I'll say that. Oh, wow, wow. Okay. Hot button, hot button. Hot yes, button. Button. Oh, yeah. I'm going to Chicago this weekend, guys. Okay. Whoa, that's politically hot. Here we go. The hot Windy City. What are you going to do there, dude? Yeah, I'm gonna going to mostly eat hot dogs and then nope. be with my family, too. Okay, nope. cool. That'll be a fun trip. Yeah, it's like a July 4th get back. Uh, I haven't been to Evanston, Illinois in over two years. Whoa. Is, uh, yeah. it's, wait, so it's like summertime shy, right? Haven't we heard like that's where dreams are? It's going off. Mm. Okay. I mean, you you need to be more. <laughs> Basically, it seems because I've been in this little bubble here in South Carolina, mm. um, Charleston for three months, and here COVID's been over for a while, mm -hmm. but elsewhere less so. So is Chicago like right back at it? Are they fully open? Seems, I have friends political. in New York that are like it, it's open. It's open, but it's you know it's a big city. So like I'm sure there could be like just a spike, and then everyone would be back uh, throwing masks on. But you know I feel like a lot of a lot of people vaxxed, throw a mask on. You can still hit up a grocery store, or like they might just because it's summertime, they might be like no dining indoors for a little bit. You know that's Who my knows? thing with Jersey Fauci. <laughs> Jersey Fauci. With me and Adam being on the south. Not to get freaking politically charged, dude. But dude we're we're dude, dude, we can't help it though. We can't help it. We're so charged. Dude, like, we can't it's help like, it. We're so charged. It drives us. Mm -hmm. I need to know. But we're over here. It's dude, the red, the blue, the it, donkeys, the elephant, the bipartisan. You. I guess green party is a thing. Oh gosh, the birthday party. Okay. Oh, what's next? The birthday party. <laughs> that is uh -huh. that's Kanye's yes, party. Sir. Yes, yes. Oh, that's funny. Mm. Points. You know, that, that was on the tip of Kyle's tongue. That's my president. Okay, thank Points. you. Okay, Kanye. Yep, yep, clear, very clear. Blake, what were you going to say? You, you seem pretty <laughs> charged over there about something politically. Yeah, kind of cooled down a little bit. I, for, uh, no, it was just like in the South, there's so much no masking and like nobody is really, like the rules are slightly. And you're being a bitch about it? Well, no, I'm starting to see my L.A. homies starting to post this shit like, some I don't even fucking know Delta. I haven't watched the, the news. Delta variant, bro. And they're it's like, political. we're masking up again. I'm like, 
I don't want to. You're not doing it? I don't want to. I don't think so, I'm gonna. Yeah. Did you jerk off on a Delta flight? That's damn right. That's the Delta I know. That's okay. the variant right there. That's the damn variant. <laughs> Very fucking something. I don't know. It just is weird having the perspective of being like out of Los Angeles and you just see how they really do head that shit. Like, I guess it comes from a good place. Like, let's be safe. Let's be careful. Let's protect everybody. But mm -hmm. God yeah. damn, I did not yeah. want to see that shit. That, that's because up. there's uh, about 10 million people all in a very uh, small area. Truly. Mm -hmm. yes, I do, yeah. Yeah, I do believe all. it's about population. Mm -hmm. uh, Blake came and visited me this past weekend. I did. And uh, it was no great. It uh -uh, was no, no fair. fair. It was very, very fun. We had a blast. We did. And this is what Blake does the night before he's leaving. We go out, we party, we have a great night. We drink until t we close the bar down. It's like this bar on the beach. There was a band playing. We were sitting out by the beach. They were serving us drinks like well after they should have been. We're, mm -hmm. we're hammered. We make it, uh, we the drive way. the golf cart back home. It's good. I'm like, it's 2.30 at night. I'm like, hey, time to wind down. Mm -hmm. And Blake, and uh, I'm like, should we smoke a joint or something? And Blake goes, oh, fuck, dude. Uh -oh. oh, man. <laughs> Shit. Uh -oh. And I go, I'm what's up? Send it. And he goes, I didn't think they'd come. And I go, <laughs> what's that now? And he goes, I invited some people over. <laughs> and I got... I got to go to bed, dude. I got to drive five hours tomorrow because he was going to the Atlanta Hawks game. He was driving oh from Charleston to Atlanta. And I go, what? All of a sudden, ding dong, there's five people <laughs> at 2.33 2, 2 a.m. at my yeah. house. Blake goes, oh, awesome. Good to see you. And I'm like, all right, I guess we'll just like make our way to the backyard, sit by the pool or whatever. And we make our way to the backyard. All of a sudden, Blake is ghosted, ghosted us. Nice. Now he's left us. Now, now more people show up. More, they've what? invited people, and so more people are in my backyard. And this is uh, your place, so now all these people, these are randos? No, these aren't randos. No, we've been partying these are, with them we've, throughout the day. We've been partying with them, and, okay. and Blake knew them from before, and they were all very okay, nice people. Okay, so they are, they are acquaintances. <laughs> these are not like, all right. Yeah. That, for but, every but I had only me. met them this weekend. It's not like I, I know these people. But, so it's a little much that you, they know where you oh. live. Okay. A little much. Well, they're not locals. They're it not wasn't locals. even that. It was the fact that it was 3 a.m. Yes. And now now Chloe's like, well, I'm going to bed. It's 3 a.m. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. she goes to bed. <laughs> and now it's just me just – and I don't – I'm, you know, I'm just – It's now it's 3 a.m. We're all drunk. The only right. thing you can do in that situation – is drink dance yep drink it's just sure. it's just drink until yeah. you've ruined the next day like right. fully ruined like you right. go to bed at three in the 3 a.m hour you got you, you can savor the next day but Can't 5 you, 6 a.m right. you've, hey. you're fucked you could were all they like <laughs> were they politically charged or just regular dude people? there wasn't that much chargedness and i think that's why i wasn't uh willing to stay up until six or seven yeah sometimes when you get in a good conversation that's like going back and forth politically like oh. time just flies you know <laughs> what's the line you threw out so were you charged did you say like you know guys i'm gonna i'm gonna call it and then no. everyone's like okay I agree. You just, he, he the said opposite. it I he went the it. opposite way. I was like trying to clear, clean yeah. my... I have a whole fridge that's just beer. It's stocked. I was right. like, maybe we try to finish this motherfucker. Whoa. Oh, okay. Like I was like, this we're going for it. And then, and then they got to like 5 a.m. And then I think they were like, okay, right. he's going harder than we want to go. <laughs> we're mm -hmm. bailing. And somehow these, there's not a... In Charleston... The Ubers are like damn near impossible right, to find. Right, right. Somehow they got an Uber at five five thirty a.m. to come pick them up, and they're like, "Oh, good, this this Uber came. We had a few that uh, that did cancel all this." And I'm like, "If you guys want a beer for the road, so you were still to, going? I'm yeah, I was going. And then the next day, I go to like clean up all the beers. I'm handing them so many different beers. I'm handing right. them a bunch of Ashley, and I'm like, taste yep, this one, taste sure. this one.'" Uh, I'm handing them all like Coors Lights, everything, and there was like everybody drank like five sips of each beer. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they were just all full. Yeah, they're every everything was full because they were just like <laughs> sipping, and meanwhile I'm like crushing, going like another round, and they're like, oh, we're good. It sounds like you were being a great host. Yeah, I was. Yeah, it's cool that you went like really hard. You went great in the situation, bro. Yeah, you I went did. Great. Yeah, I know it worked out, but I'm saying. Th that, uh, that I love that me and Blake are close enough that he felt comfortable leaving right. me in that situation. <laughs> Blake, what's your perspective on the situation? How did how did this? 
What'd you do? I mean, that's chunking, chunking, chunkaroo. That's about right. I mean, I threw out the bat signal to the homies we were partying with earlier, like earlier in the night. I'm like, hey, we're out at these bars, these bars. And right. then I guess I was like, we're going to head to Adams, but they didn't get out till, there till I was like, uh, my head has to hit the pillow. Alan. Because mm-hmm. I had to drive all the way back to Atlanta. And mm-hmm. if I would have gone to bed at five, I would have died on the drive yeah it was sure. a it was a really rough mm-hmm. it was a really rough next how day. far is that drive five hours yeah, yeah five hours wow i got i got i was talking to my homies the other day and they brought back a story of when they were driving back from madison to chicago madison wisconsin chicago they were so hung over illinois pulled, Il, what <laughs> is this political Il, illinois chicago <laughs> illinois it's correct yes okay. is this gonna get political uh, they were so hungover they just pulled over on the side of the freeway and went to sleep in like the ditch for like an hour and a half. Dude, the thought <laughs> crossed my mind. I was they so were like, close I to can't. doing that. I'm gonna I've, barf. I'm gonna like, I'm gonna crash. Let's just pass. That's out. how MJ's dad was murdered. You can't. That's do right. That. Yeah, you, you can't, can't do, do that. that. No, not on the side no, no. of the road. They didn't. They weren't in the car. They went. Like to sleep oh. in the grass. Oh, even safer. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> like the out of the car. Oh. Even safer. Uh, How crazy uh, is that? Well, That's yeah, insane. I mean, yeah. You could have done that. The thing is, this is forty. We're You're getting like older. We're, we're, we're make, we need to be making a little bit better decisions. I mean, I yeah. remember back in the day, we, me and uh, Austin Anderson, mm-hmm. friend of the pod, we yes, would sir. drive up to Santa Barbara. When we were like 18 years old and we'd go to Santa Barbara and then we'd walk around and look for open houses and meet the kids that were renting their rooms like on, um, what is that main drag called? Like Playa Vista, I think. And mm-hmm. Sounds would real. go and be like interested in like renting a room and then would be like, well, uh, what are you guys doing tonight? Maybe we should party and see our future roommates. <laughs> and, and and then high sp- everyone high had parties. So we on. did that like five different places. <laughs> this get is all how these like murderers prep people. Get all these people's <laughs> numbers, and then at that night we would just like call each one and be like, "What are you guys doing?" And they're like, "Hey, meet us at this party. These guys might rent, rent a room." We had no. We just I'm wanted to go party. And why we, did you we, want to do that up in Santa Barbara as opposed to where you guys were in college? It was a fun thing. It was a fun thing to go do because we hadn't experienced Santa Barbara yet. So we mm. were just like, let's go up. Uh, and then we would end up, uh, we did this like three times. And would we you ended crash up, at their houses? We we did twice and one time. This is what would kind of uh, percolated this memory was once I tried to sleep in the car with Austin. Like we just pulled over on the side of the road and just started to sleep. And he was snoring so loudly that I just slept in the yard next to the car. <laughs> Mm-hmm. the car and i remember like just people were jo- like uh, i remember just a girl was jogging at like 6 30 in the morning and i'm like jesus christ just shaking yeah. her head I at you rock dude <laughs> you just roll over and start doing push-ups and you're like you got to get after it am i right <laughs> yeah i do pu- push-ups in my own puke yeah <laughs> there was a time when i was so drunk and i drove down to orange county from la from allegedly school allegedly yeah, allegedly Goodbye. drove down to see blake at his father's house uh and i was so wasted and i think i did some cocaine that night and then oh. i made phone calls i remember making phone calls the whole way down and then finding a beach and then sleeping on the beach. This yeah. is when the listeners go, yep, that's why he's mm-hmm. the sober friend. <laughs> Dude, I slept on the beach and woke up at 11 a.m. And there was a volleyball game happening like over me. <laughs> that's amazing. <laughs> you just woke up. You need a fourth, man. <laughs> Dude, I was fully jean jacketed oh. out, too. Like, I was fully, I had jean jacket on, oh, sunglasses, man. pants, and just like. I bet you had a really sick mm-hmm. trucker hat during that time, too. I remember, I remember that. I feel Kyle. like there's a detail you're missing, Kyle. Kyle, What's the did detail? you not have like a fake silver grill in your mouth like teeth <laughs> yeah probably oh, wow. dude i feel probably. like you might have woke up with some fa- like a fake grill in your mouth do you think they yeah. thought you washed up from the shore <laughs> they thought you were a pirate <laughs> oh my god a pirate from it's another a, time it's a shipwrecked man <laughs> <laughs> that man is shipwrecked it's a dirty brown water pirate that's yeah. my best friend don't touch it this is pre carl from workaholics so there's no explanation other than you were an insane Captain Jack Sparrow, probably pre-Captain yeah. Jack. I feel like when we were younger, we were just more um, willing to sleep places that, that weren't 
Yeah. Yeah. You don't run yeah. the numbers in your head of survival. You just go, yeah, I'm going to go to bed right here. I'm right. betting that uh, in the Ozarks, I'm just going to find a corner of wherever we're sleeping, and I'm just going to do the hands in the armpits just laying on the yeah. door. I hope that's the, that's, I hope that that's for it. you. I'm going to just sleep in a little owl's house in a tree. Mm -hmm. Fold up in a little ball. Mm -hmm. Oh, Adam doesn't like owls. <laughs> at the batch, sleeping at a bachelor party is honestly the hardest thing to get accomplished. Like you, you don't have a room. You don't have anything. There's you don't right. think about that when planning the bachelor party, and then yeah. like twenty people. <laughs> I love the dude in the bachelor party emails. Is like, yeah, but for real though. The bed situation. What's the deal? I just <laughs> nope. need my, need my That's eight hours. No, nope. <laughs> it's a free for all when you Dude, get there. Dude, bachelor party email chains are the funniest thing. It it's is. Just it will be a free for all. There is there is no special treatment. Whoever gets there, whoever gets off that uh, bus or whatever we're we're using to pick all you guys up first and gets into the rooms. <laughs> mm -hmm. That's yours, man. It's yours. But but Adam, what you're saying <laughs> makes sense, but bachelor parties don't make sense because somebody's yeah. gonna knock out early and be and, in your bed and you're gonna be like, mm -hmm. right. Oh fuck. And if you throw a piece of pizza up my asshole, <laughs> I'm I'm gonna kill you at your bachelor party, buddy. Whoa, Good boy. Whoa. Yeah, but that would be good for the pod, man. That's true. We're gonna, gonna live stream the Rubble. entire thing. We do it for the pod, man. Maybe I'll get that like a important. maybe I'll get like a fucking tent or something and just like plan on going outside. Maybe you yeah, think nobody's gonna be, cool. be in that tent? They, I'm gonna fuck with you, bro. If you're in a tent out there, I'm gonna be. Oh, uh, we're cuddling. We're keeping each other warm. Bro. What are you talking about? <laughs> There's some things gonna happen in that tent. I'm excited for what goes down in the tent. I like one of those hammocks, like a pocket hammock or something. That's probably a good move. A That's a good hammock? move. Yeah, those hammocks that are like nylon, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm a, yeah. Five guys will definitely piss on you. <laughs> yeah, just kick me. Just fucking kick kick me and try to swing me five, around five shit. late 30s damn near 40 year old uh, i like to practice my my drop kicks on the dude in the hand get yeah get him <laughs> fucking i'll be sleeping in here there's a pile of shit in here huh okay all right i guess i will be uh sleeping okay. somewhere else yo let's right. drop kick this uh, thing okay <laughs> hammock's uh, ruined okay, okay. <laughs> All right, yeah. hammocks ruined. Kyle, cool. tried, Kyle tried to go to bed at nine o'clock. <laughs> tired, dude. dude. I'm fucking tired, bro. I'm You're just bringing a pillow. I think I'm gonna bring like a little pa camping pillow. That's all I need. Hands and yeah. armpits. Passing. Well, Blake just stayed here with me this past weekend, and he didn't undo the covers. Didn't get <laughs> under the covers. He's a monster. He slept on top of the covers and it also doesn't even look like he used a pillow he didn't Did get under that? the covers and it seemed like he went out of the way to not use pillows but this is the same dude who in hotels will not sleep on the bed he'll just sleep on the floor he'll sleep with on like, the, oh, yeah, the what the fuck is next that to shit? the bed i think he's the weirdest guy i know the fact that he just invited a bunch of people over <laughs> at 3 a.m then goes to bed then doesn't Go underneath the covers. No. Very nice. It's a very nice house. These guest rooms are are great. I could yeah, see if it, this is like a room. dorm dorm room or something, and you're like, I don't know. There might be all kinds of weird shit underneath here. It's like these are right. linens, Blake. Mm. You these are linens with things. linens. Honestly, I think in my mind, I don't do it because I get hot easily when I sleep. So I just sleep on top. We yeah. also, we also first night explained to him how the thermostat upstairs worked. I was That's like, "This right. is yours, so you can do it. Whatever. If you like it really cold, you could just mm -hmm. put it really cold." And he's like, "Right on." Mm -hmm. <laughs> did not touch the thermostat. <laughs> Slept on top of the covers. Though. I just didn't get comfortable. Like, didn't no. even try to get comfortable. In his clothes, with for that? sure. Oh uh, yeah, I didn't peel down. I no. can't Don't care. do that. I run hot. I gotta get the clothes off. I was. I mean, I yeah. was exhausted. I was sure. done. Yeah, we were going hard, man. Yeah, probably we sleep went... better under the covers, man. True. <laughs> like in a True. nice, cool room, you probably. Mm -hmm. get I don't know why sleep. I was so tired. I guess it's because I <laughs> sleep on the floor. <laughs> I slept in my jeans on top of the bed. Dude, the more I think, like that weird, that weird drunk sleep where you're you're not awake, but you wake up like you didn't sleep at all. Yeah, it's, it's called alcohol poisoning. You're almost <laughs> dead. Pot, hot, you, know that, hot, hot. you know that weird sleep? It's not sleep necessarily, but you can't move and the room is spinning. You know that? Sleep paralysis. You know, when the, when the, when <laughs> yes. the Grim Reaper visits you. 
<laughs> we had a lot of fun this weekend. That's all I'll say. <laughs> uh, well, I will say that it took like so long to not be drunk for me that next day. Like I understand why you mm -hmm. had to stop drinking because you drink Thank until you. five, Thank six a.m. <laughs> You would have been drunk for part of that drive home, and you don't want to do that. Yeah, no. no. I was making the responsible choice by going to bed at 3 in the morning. What would yes. you eat for breakfast on before you left? How did you get your mind right? Oh, he, didn't, didn't, he didn't even grab no. coffee. We have coffee here. What did you do like, for five hours? You hit a gas I, station? I called him like a, like a half hour into his drive I, when I woke up. He's like, yeah, I left like a half hour, 45 minutes ago, something like that. And I'm like, oh, cool. Uh, you get it? You get anything to eat here? And he goes, no, I really sh could use a coffee or something. Though. <laughs> and I'm, I'm like, you didn't stop to get yourself something? And he's like, no. Nah. Dude, leaves no trace. This cat, you, no. don't, he'll, you don't know where he's been, where he's going. <laughs> it's not malicious, dude. I just don't think about it. <laughs> Like, You're it's wild though. Like, dumbass. I forgot to eat last week. Yeah, there's a kitchen there. There's coffee pods right there. Look, I God, had like half nice. a. I had half a can of Coke Zero in the car from the day before. So. <laughs> Yo, yeah. true. So You're kind of weaned off of that. You're good um, to go. Wait, so when you went to the gas station, because it's a five-hour drive, you gotta go. Yes. You, you ain't go inside and just get like and a fucking jerk off. Oh, <laughs> jerk I thought you <laughs> get a GameStop. What's it called? Game? Yeah, yeah. You, well, Blake, we've established you like to jerk off in weird, weird scenarios. Yeah. Did you kick yeah, it in the car? Did you? Did you? Did you do it? I'm reformed, man. That's not okay. how. That's not how I get down anymore. That was that's a not how you are anymore. Me. But you didn't get like Doritos a drive, or like a fucking control? Twix. No, because or Skittles. Skittles. <laughs> I would have loved a Twix. I would have loved Skittles. Those would be yes. delicious. But Best here's candies. the thing: I was headed straight for the Atlanta Hawks game, and we had a box where there was a whole like going to be a whole buffet. Five I'll hours later, broom. after drinking yeah. all day and all night. Eyes on the prize. That's why you're a natural hard body. You know what I, I would have done? I would have stopped at a diner by myself. Yes. Oh, yeah. I would have gotten a weird, like, the, what's great about the South is you're mm -hmm. driving on these backcountry roads, and there's just, like, a legit old school <laughs> roads uh, on <laughs> the backcountry <laughs> roads, and th there's, like, a legit old school cute diners everywhere. You could have just stopped at one of them. Yo, my man loves cute diners. A pancake, an egg. Dude, a, a southern slam? Coffee. Just some biscuits and gravy? Yeah, yeah, you could have did and then, that. And then got on yeah. the road, dude. I know. Well, I will say, what like. What he did is he didn't stop. He didn't drink a a drink of one drink of water he just just white knuckled it for five hours straight <laughs> until, Damn right. until he was at the atlanta hawks game. well because i will say that on the drive up to you in south carolina i did like stop off to go to like a truck stop like oh this will be cute this little diner or whatever there's a mm -hmm. big sign mm -hmm. i pulled up and it just kind of wasn't cute at all it felt kind of backwards mm -hmm. to me so i'm like Nah, I'm gonna go. Yeah, but and that's then I... the cool shit, dude. You gotta get a little backwards. You look like you you act like. I know you don't think you fit in, but with that <laughs> hair, dude, you fit. I in. don't know. I yeah. didn't see a lot of long hairs out our way. Yeah. I've seen Easy Rider. Have you seen Easy Rider? They get smoked just for being yeah, long hairs that in was, that movie. That, that, 1967. Yeah, or that was a while what? ago. Oh yeah, fucking Easy Rider. That shit's troublesome mm -hmm. that has yeah. been bit. <laughs> again uh half century ago yeah oh, oh shit God. that shit that did happen Wait, so, in a movie here, 50 years that shit ago is troublesome, but here's what i'm bro. thinking here's what i'm thinking so you got to the game you went straight to the game as we've established no shower no wipe your nuts nothing so here right? but i'm sure no I'm sure he changed clothes he did that yeah. blake is oh, a cleanly okay. man but okay, but good. as far Thank as you. you get there you didn't eat first. You grabbed a drink first. <laughs> oh, good, good question. You had a beer before you ate anything, right? Absolutely. I got a Michelob Ultra. They were free. And then what did you eat? Well, they had a nice bread. I had two hot dogs. I had a, two slices of pizza. I oh, had there, some chicken. Okay. I had some coleslaw. I had a okay. salad. We, and we, we went out. Hey, when you heard the dribbling of those balls, <laughs> did it get something inside of you just kind of going? That you had to dip off in the yes, bathroom sir. and... <laughs> Yeah, the squeaking of the shoes. No, I don't go to the bathroom. I was just in the box with everybody else. I just threw oh, like sure. one of the free T-shirts over my lap and then just <laughs> get it done, dude. Yeah. yeah, everybody's like, why is he going so ape shit over this free, free T-shirt? You're like, me, me, right here, right here, me, me, me. They're like, ah, I guess I, uh, Blake Anderson oh, really wants this free T-shirt. Here you go, buddy. <laughs> <They throw it laughs> to him. Can I get another one? Oh, yes, yes. <laughs>
Man. <laughs> Let me get a couple over here, dude. I don't know. Yeah, he just piles them on his lap and sits right there. It's like, uh, <laughs> it's pretty chill. I it's guess. a joke. Keep sending them. <laughs> it's yeah. funnier. The more I get, it's funnier. Well, <laughs> uh, I jerked off in a TJ Maxx once. <laughs> And Damn, this was it. <laughs> I think we might be a little premature oh, on ending it, but uh, God, that'd be good. Yeah. Wait, did yeah. you? Because you remember, like, the most legit hiding spot when you were like in like oh, in the circle stores. Oh, was you yeah, go the through the clothes? No, it wasn't. I, I must have been like twelve, thirteen, something like that. I was at the register, and yeah, I was at the register. <laughs> I just locked eyes. Um, beautiful, like looked like a wolf. This dude and um, no, I was <laughs> I was uh, sitting in a chair. I'm like waiting for my mom to buy shit, uh, and there's it's just TJ Maxx. There's just shit everywhere. There's not a lot of people around. I'm like wearing a big jacket, and uh, I'm like wearing a coat. You know, it's it's winter in Nebraska, and I just I just I just jerked off. It was I was bored. It was out of boredom. Right. It so was like a put, jerk right. off out of boredom, yeah. and. Uh, but then I noticed a security guard who was kind of looking at me and it's kind of hard to jerk off and not like Come. move, you move your arm. <laughs> so I think, I think he probably was like this motherfucker's jerking off in this TJ Maxx. Right. But then I couldn't stop because it was, I was too far down the process. So I just kept, kept going, even though right. I'm pretty sure I was already spotted. Like yeah. spotted, like you spotted your pants, like you were preying. <laughs> You were preying? Was that the first time you preed? The yeah, the pants were messed up. I what I did is I went in the uh, bathroom afterwards and threw them away. Mm -hmm. Oh, and you I'm were doing like, that. And you were like, "Mom, I want to mm. buy these pants. I'm going to wear them out of the TJ Maxx." <laughs> <laughs> you threw your pants away? You threw no, not the pants. Away. The undies. The undies. Yeah, yes. I've thrown my undies away uh, when I my Joe before. boxers. My Joe boxers. <laughs> oh, Kyle, do tell about your sharding. Oh, sharting. lots of. I've, I've so sharted. So you were jacking <laughs> off and then sharted. <laughs> Well, yeah, I was jacking off. That was all clean. This was pretty. <laughs> no, dude, I've just thrown my undies away because I have shit right. myself before. Like, wow, well, on a shift Diarrhea. at Brenda Teeters. <laughs> dude, me too. Sure. We both shit our similar... pants at the same job. I think we threw them out in the same place too, right? Like that. Do you guys think you ate <laughs> something? Next door what spot. Happened? Fucking, I love teriyaki. Did, did you throw them out there? <laughs> oh, you, you guys ate at a place called Yay. I Love Teriyaki. It was bomb, dude. They'd give yeah, discounts so to everybody who worked at Brennan Theaters, and it was very delicious. But yeah. it was rich. Yeah, <laughs> it was. So you guys, rich. I like. I it's happened to me. I, it must have been a few times, but just the one time that I really remember it was the stand-up comedy night that I said in one of the very first podcasts. Uh, yeah, the, right, the whole right. turd. Where, yeah, the whole turd came out and I put it in the pot of plant wrapped mm -hmm. in a right. napkin. Uh, but this, it sounds like it happens fairly frequently to you, Kyle. Uh, why do you think that is? Do you think it's all the veggies? Do you think maybe... You need... <laughs> no, no. This is something that's been going on since I was the meat eater. I just have, like, leakage. Um, oh, you got a seepage situation. It's a seep situation. Yeah, yeah it's just like... A loose-o? What are we thinking? Like, well, I think sphincters? I just sometimes you I push... Rolling? No, sometimes I just uh -huh. push too hard to fart, and then, you know, some right. stuff comes uh -huh. out. You know, it's like, <laughs> sure. that's what happens. It is a delicate mm. dance, and sometimes you're like, I got total control of... Nope, I just shit my pants. I have a fart right now if you guys would like to hear it. Would you like to hear okay. it? Yay. Yes, yes. Nah, I don't. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God, <laughs> dude. What? Dude. Was Stereo surround yes. sound. Oh, that, that, now it's yeah. Dolby. <laughs> that didn't sound real at all. Dude. <laughs> smells real, Bam. <laughs> oh, smells real. My. God. Yeah, yeah. No, so I have I have great farts, like fantastic farts, and I always want to hear them, and I always well, want to give my best when right. I have if my I may. performance. Oh, God. And sometimes it's it's shit. I just want to say, like, based on hearing the like slap, the snap, crackle, and pop of your butthole, it does not sound like it's very tight. Like, I feel like things would slip out of that. Correct. That's just, what it was like. Just from clappage. the audio, you could tell that that things could slide out. Yeah, I mean, it, it just had a flatness to it, you know, kind of like a, a little too loose and slappy. You yeah, know? It, it popped. I got the on me. It popped. Correct. Yes. Yeah. Correct. Okay. Yeah. Yes. That's an and then you gave it, it. I thought it was all done, and then you gave it extra. Yeah. Which tells me that's when you're really playing with fire. That's when things. That's when seepage happens. It's also when the funniest farts happen when you think you're done, and then you hit them again. You know what I mean? And, and we're not. Yeah, pulsing of action mm. is good for the comedy. It's science. But yes, it comes with um, a raw deal where sometimes you shit yourself. <laughs>
Yeah. Hey, man, you play with fire, you get burned. <laughs> the raw deal of shitting yourself every once in a while. I agree. Well, brother. you ever, you know, when it started happening, when I was like obsessed with lighting my farts on fire. Oh, like right. tor- torquing. That's, Are we talking about torquing? Wait, tor- torquing. <laughs> yeah. What's torquing? Is that what you call it? Torquing? Yeah. We call it. Oh, that's <laughs> torquing and versus torquing. It's not torching. We called it torquing. Why did you call it that? And this is just lighting your farts on fire. I don't know. That's what. I, that's how I learned it at summer camp, and I used to fucking. You know what I think happened? I think they said torching. You said torquing. No one, no one told you otherwise. Then you took that home from Southern as uh, summer camp. Southern camp. Camp. (laughs) Camp. Mama, they're out here talking. More southern. Uh, Uh, Do you think that because torquing doesn't make any sense? Torching makes perfect sense. I will say a couple things. That's possible. I'll say that's Mm -hmm. possible. Secondly, <laughs> secondly, hot. Does it have to make sense? Half of this shit never makes sense. Just, what's True. what's chorging? chorging makes well, yeah. a lot of sense to me. <laughs> chorging sounds. Chor- what is it? It's an onomatopoeia. That's an onomatopoeia. I, I, let's leave it to the people out there. Slide in mm-hmm. his DMs. Let them know if torquing is a thing. Is it torquing or is it torching? But yeah, that was a very fun. I, I'm not saying if it fun. is one or the other because I'm sure there's variants out there that like Delta. It's both. There's variants. It's the it's the Delta well, variant. Yeah. Call it whatever you want. If people have never heard of torquing before, let me know. T O R K I N G. Oh, it's okay. a K. It's not even a Q. Q. All right. Yeah. Cool. Torque down. Yeah, but I was very good at lighting my farts on fire. And, you were. Uh, I definitely did it every time I possibly could. Um, and this guys, has been an episode. Of <laughs> and you guys uh, were, I mean, you guys were Bay Area, <laughs> the like suburbs, that. 45 That's minutes right. uh, outside right. of the Bay Area. <laughs> and, Tom Hanks. Uh, <laughs> where Tom Hanks East is from. Yeah, Bay well, Area, Oakland. 45 <laughs> minutes away from Oakland. Yeah. And where Tom Hanks uh, is not 45. from. 30, but yeah. Oh, cool. But you, so you guys right. would 45 minutes from sag the stadium, right? your pants down so fucking far. Correct. So your whole asshole is hanging out. That is correct. And so there's just one tiny little thin piece of fabric mm. between yes. an open flame and your well, gaping, gas leaking <laughs> asshole. Well, we uh-huh. thought that was the safe way to do it because Blake, didn't mm-hmm. your dad have a horror story about like when he did it bare ass well, and yeah, his asshole actually sucked the. You could do it. His through asshole jeans. actually sucked the. I don't know if it was your dad who did this, but <laughs> some, one of his friends. <laughs> well, this is what I was about well, to ask now you that guys. Now your dad uh, <laughs> listens to the podcast. I'm so pretty sure it's your dad. And what is this all about? <laughs> <laughs> No, that was what I was about to ask you dudes was I was like, did you hear the urban like legend where some kid kind of was trying to light his fart on fire and the <coughs> flame sucked up into his asshole and burned mm. his intestines? And I believe that 100 percent. Yeah, you no, do. I, th- I thought that was your dad. No, my dad's too. asshole is fully functioning to my knowledge. <laughs> See, so I thought I was being Goodbye. safe by going through the pants. But I think I might have fucked up my ass and caused uh, oh, a seepage. So this is the root? Oh. You have like a charred Wait. hole? <laughs> yeah, I think I, I think this co- <laughs> That's right. I I can draw a correlation between lighting my porch on fire. And- say, I can draw a picture of my butthole for you guys. <laughs> Freehand from memory. <laughs> It is just a black blob. Just squat over a mirror just... and give me a charcoal drawing of it, please. Yeah. I could draw a picture of my butt. Like holding your nuts and up post. and just kind of. <laughs> but yeah, I think it caused seepage. Be careful out there, kids. Just be careful. Yeah, it's fun. Be careful with torquing or torching or. And do it you if you're gonna it. do it. Do it through your underwear and your shorts or at pants. least underwear. underwear. At yeah. least. So underwear. I jerk off in TJ Maxx's. <laughs> yes, Blake sir. is a notorious uh, airplane. Jay, always. Kyle about- shits his pants all, more often than not. Yeah. Yeah. Jers, what's up? What's 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 your thing? What's when, your where did you jerk secret? off, or what happened with uh, your poops, or do you? Piss, you, just, you got a drip you drop. Just pissed on your um, stuff all the time. Or? Comes out of do, I do love this podcast. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I, the, the, the one it's like quick truth thing. or dare. <laughs> we're like <Yeah>. little girls. <laughs> hey, where else were you gross or violating? I, I, the one thing that pops in my head, I, I think I told the story about when I shit at South by Southwest um, in, the ba- in the shower and then later at the like Converse like giveaway store we were oh and we were all together. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, what happened yes. though? I don't know what happened. I do remember I was there. this. And this is. 
adulthood too. So this isn't this isn't even we this were talking starting like the youth, career youthful stories. We were oh. talking just as like eight years ago or something. So yeah, after drinking beers for like forty eight hours, you know, you're yeah, an awesome. You're, you're pounding some lone stars. Yeah. Um, oh yeah. And, yeah. So getting ready for the day because we kind of get like important. we get carted <laughs> around. <laughs> right, we get carted around all this stuff. There's kind of like an agenda. So like, hey, shower, meet us down here. So I'm like, all right, I'm in the shower. Like Kyle, I'm like, all right, I got mm-hmm. a fart. I'm just going to rip it. So I could, and then mm. it just, I just shit mm-hmm. into the shower. And I was like, oops. <laughs> Squared out. I think oh, this okay. is why I don't shit in. Uh, I, I, I'm never forcing farts out. Farts sometimes leak out of me. Yeah, but oh. I didn't I think I didn't that's want the issue. To, that's, well, that's leaking. Is, anyway. Um, <laughs> no, but diarrhea in the shower is. Diarrhea. So, so then we go to this Converse like, diarrhea, giveaway. Diarrhea thing and it's set up in like a house or something right do you guys remember this they had like an american flag made out of yes. right, white and blue shoes yeah. yes. and there's two very bathrooms. cute cute installment there's two bathrooms one has a line <laughs> and i'm like i am gonna shit my pants uh the other one um has no line right so i go in that one it's just got a toilet and i'm like well i'll go i'll take a piss because we were just slamming beers so I piss, and on like while I'm pissing, I just shit my underwear, right? Oh. And so it's just a toilet. There's not even a sink in there. There's not even a garbage can, right? Fuck. Fuck. And I'm, like, I'm laughing extra hard because I know out of the four of us, Durs would be the funniest to have this situation happen to. <laughs> full, full, and it's like it's like ninety five degrees, and I'm like, okay, so I get my underwear off and I just bunch them up in my hand, and then I go and I like stand. Toss them to Isaac. I go, no, I go, <laughs> yeah, I toss them to my manager. I say, manage this. Man- um, <laughs> manage my ass. And then, or maybe I kept them on. Fuck, I don't know. But I go and stand in the other line for the other bathroom because I see that it's got like full everything in there. Um, And then I get in there. Peanut butter. Get the underwear off. Bury it under like all the paper towels that are there. Wash my hands and get the fuck out of there. And then I was just free balling it for the rest of the day. Nice. Um, Fully chafing. You know, no thigh gap here. So. Uh. Good job. Um, Sounds like you yeah. handled it like a pro. <laughs> it sounds like you MacGyvered your diarrhea. The, well done. But dude. here's here's the here's the one that's that stuck out in my uh, memories is that I was at church one time, right? And the one time Durs went to church. Well, no, my fa- my parents took me to hell at church as a kid. Um, I just didn't believe it. So hell at church. So much church. It was it was not fun for anybody, including the people Thank there. Thank you, God. But so. I can't, we were like, we were like, and I wiped or, my ass with the homily. <laughs> getting, we were getting ready for like singing or choir or something like that, right? And I'm like, hey, I want to go to the bathroom so I can just bail. And they're like, okay, hurry back. So I go to the bathroom and they have urinals that go all the way down to the floor. You know those ones, right? Mm-hmm. The so, best ones. And they put ice in the bottom of them. Yeah, I love not, pissing not on in this that church, ice. Not in this lord's, <laughs> this lord's house. Yeah. Uh, it wasn't a sports stadium. But so I'm in sweatpants because I'm like. <laughs> 10 i guess and i just point my dick straight down i'm like looking up at the ceiling like you're hey. in sweatpants at church it's like a daytime or like a a youth like okay, a it's like a youth thing. thing yeah you might do yeah. a climbing what kind of a church bullshit. is this that doesn't check out um i don't know it was like people you're a die. liar yeah sweatpants <laughs> at church not at my church all right. Anyway, everyone at home's like, this story is so boring. Can we just get through it? <laughs> Button uh, up, buttoned up shirts. So I, I'm, I'm taking a piss, like pointing down at the bottom of the urinal. And I just like kind of look up at the ceiling. And then I look down when I'm done pissing. And I'd pissed all over my sweatpants. Oh, yeah. like, no. that is a bummer. Almost them. entirely. Right. And I feel I'm like, like I've had that. Yeah. I'm yeah. like, fuck. So I got like a long shirt because it's Blake. What decade is it? 90s baby it's the 90s so i'm like stretching yeah, the shirt. Yeah. there's no way to fucking dry it i gotta go back in there i go back to like this room where they're doing choir or whatever and i just sit and i pull my shirt over my knees like they used to do in the sure. 90s uh, like, yeah, sure. like, you know, sure. kids, yeah baby yeah kids stretch their whatever and yes. so they were like uh okay we're gonna like get up and do choir and i was like I'm not doing it. And they were like, what is prob- what's your problem? I'm like, I don't want to do it. But I'm like covering my fucking whatever. They're like, fine, you stay there. And then they like went and did it uh, like in front of me, like we're all like rehearsing the thing. Then like finally she's like, you know what? I've had enough. And it's been, it's probably been 20 minutes or a half hour. It's and she cool like grabs my arms. She pulls me up 
Oh. And I look down and it's fully dried. <gasps> and, and that's Thank when I was God. like, <laughs> yeah. I was like, Thank you, God. This God guy is pretty oh my cool. God. He's got oh my, my back. God. That but, is the way the Lord works. Did you believe after that? No, what I found out was that <laughs> there was a guy in the urinal holding, holding my dick down that I didn't mm -hmm. see. And then mm -hmm. the same guy was yeah. under my chair the whole time blowing it dry. Oh yeah. my what? God. He's in jail. Okay. He's in jail. Now this checks out. <laughs> this was an elder. But I could not <laughs> believe it was dry. It was crazy. That, I was yeah. like, I would say that would that's drive a miracle. The Lord, even... the Lord works uh, in mysterious ways. I've done, ways. <laughs> uh, yeah, I got, dude, I got these awesome. big ass thighs, right? Mm, so yes. sometimes, mm, sometimes when I'm sitting on a toilet, they hot. press together and then it like wedges my dick up. My dick goes like <laughs> shlink underneath me. Right. And so then okay. I Wait, will. What? And underneath you? Hold on Kyle, a second. Yeah. What's you up? draw that, Kyle? Well, no, I'm trying to draw. I'm trying to figure that out. What are you Kyle, saying? Draw me like one of your buttholes. My show God. us. Just show us like how Blake showed us the fruit basket. <laughs> I can't really. It wedges no! your dick up underneath your bum? Yeah, cause, because my legs pr are pressing together and I, I do my best to stick it all the way down. But I'm looking at my phone. I'm not doing, you know. And mm -hmm. so like this happens yeah. to me. Right, kind of, exactly. not, and you like, shoot through the seat. You seats. shoot through the the seat yeah. and the the bottom, and yep. then it hoses uh. the back of your pants. So it, it's you piss yourself, but somehow in the back, yep. that I will then uh, oh grab a uh, hair dryer and just dry them. <laughs> so right. I think like I've had at parties uh, before where. People think I'm just in there blow drying right. my hair for like five right minutes. Out. Yeah, and people are like, "What it's the science. fuck?" And I'm like, eh, "You know, you just act like uh, you, you piss yourself." It? Yeah, <laughs> fixing my hair. Fixing oh, my I, hair. oh, oh, you mean like, oh, I piss myself. I'm using the <laughs> oh, hair dryer. Yeah, sure, I piss myself. <laughs> right. Yeah, I was really right. in there drying the back of my pants. Yeah, it's because I piss myself because I got fat thighs and wedged my dick up and it points directly through. The Adam, he got the little tiny hole. Between it doesn't, the top and the bottom. If that's any consolation, it, it happens to everybody. Like it's not. I don't think. Well, these guys are asking like acting like it's no, never it's happened. because I think it's because the way you're describing it, it's like inconsequential. Like it does. It just. It was you, more about your piss. thighs. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's I was following I, that's the thighs. What I imagine. Why? What the issue was? Does, yeah. does it, it's happened to you, Kyle? Or because you looked at me like I was a fucking lunatic. A well, uh, no, ago. I just didn't quite get. I didn't quite get yeah. the the visual. I didn't okay, but now that it. you get it, have you done that to yourself? I mean, I I have yes, I yes, I've missed <laughs> the mark. Okay. Yes. I like that I'm, we're peer pressuring Kyle into admitting he's pissed his pants. <laughs> yes, yeah. you have. No, I haven't. Yes, you I have. pissed on my pants while sitting and taking yes. a shit. Sure, yes, yes, yes you yes, fucked yes, it yes, up. Yes, like, now Blake, got, God, Blake. isn't that crazy? You make it to the toilet and you still piss your pants. <laughs> you still piss your pants. <laughs> yeah, that's fucking. Blake, is that happened to you, brother? That's happened to you before. Yeah, I've I've been sitting peeing and pissed through the seat. Yeah, so this is a, a, I feel like a global phenomenon that the men aren't talking about. And right. this is why we have this platform, guys, so yeah, we right. can really get out in front of these mm -hmm. so what's the fix? issues. What's yeah. the fix politically? Yeah. No doubt. Yeah. Well, you don't charge me up. <laughs> charge it up, man. How do you that fix this? Important. Who's which party is gonna fix this? Okay. I don't know. <laughs> Left, right, up, down. Who knows? I'm too charged. All yeah. right. Hey, before we get too politically charged here, <laughs> does anybody have any uh, <laughs> take backs or apologies? Uh, uh, you know what? Handouts, I'll, handouts, I would like refunds. To, I would like to apologize <laughs> right up top by mm -hmm. I didn't mean to come at him. You know, mm. I wasn't trying to come at him. Mm. I was just trying to get a fun <laughs> topic going. I just listened to the other to a snippet of the other podcast where Blake told the jerking off to Tomb Raider story, and I'm like, mm -hmm. I was like, well, he should talk about that on our right. podcast. Yeah, that's you know? fertile. That's fertile. That's, that's yeah. fertile ground. I wasn't I wasn't trying to come <laughs> after you, and so I would like to apologize to Blake if because I knew he was on his heels mm -hmm. right away. Right, guys? Yeah. We well, we were all kind of oh, yeah. going at him, and it felt like. He was on his heels, and I don't want him to feel like that. Right. No, it's okay. It's okay. It's just I know when we kick off a pod with cum, we're going to ride the cum slide the whole way, baby. <laughs> yeah. We're on that true. wave. True, true, yeah. true, 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 true. And those are this, some of the I mean, the, the name of this one should just be uh, cum and shit, right? Cum and ride shit. Ride the cum slide. Oh ride the cum God. slide we're with sick. the boys. This we're, is sick. Important. Hey, we're sick. We're kind we're sick. Of nasty we need help. Dudes. Yeah. Uh, I'll apologize to Adam. My bad mm -hmm. for just peacing out on the party right mm -hmm. when 
of the people I invited got True. to your place. I had to get that Hawks game, but it sounds like you handled it like a champion. So I'm proud I think to I say handled you're it okay. Friend. Yeah. Right. Uh, do you think that maybe and uh, you know I'm I'm not I haven't gone to any counseling, but maybe there was some deep seated thing about that that that's why I came at you unintentionally oh, maybe a little hard maybe, yeah, yeah maybe that was a vengeance uh ploy that maybe. and i didn't even realize that you know i don't know adam you refuse to go to any sort of therapy so i don't know mm. I don't, no, I don't. <laughs> i've never <laughs> done therapy I don't and know we'll the, never know the right yeah, we'll terms. never know yeah i don't know how that yeah. beautiful mind works brother but <laughs> maybe <laughs> you got um, me <laughs> got I'll, you, I'll, I'll compliment you anders yeah. Uh, for handling that shard attack like with grace and um, mm. just being wonderful out there in Austin. I was right yeah. there next to you, and I don't remember it, and I just can't believe that you handled it and did I all that. I told you guys just, like after the fact. I was like, I don't listen to you that often. Yes, I remember this story, but but vaguely. <laughs> oh. I remember I take just because you, you played it so cool. Grace, I, Grace is what Kyle. The Grace, word right? Yes. Grace and composure, yes. like yes. killer Grace and composure under shard attack, mm -hmm. killer job. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Yep. Really Thanks. good stuff. I feel like South by is a, a pretty good place to have it go down because everyone's drunk. You're yeah, drunk. a lot of people it's, have shit their pants at South yeah. by Southwest. I yes. the, yeah, most people have. If I most would, if have. I would, yeah, if um, I had to guess, it was sixty percent for sure. Shitty. Yeah, pants. I'm shitting my pants ninety five percent of my life. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yep. And if I, I, I do have a take back. All right. I just want to take back all the mm. time I spent in church. Mm. If I could just, if I could just get Whoa. that back. Mm. Thank you, God. Mm. Wow! Back. Even as the Lord reached down with His hot breath and dried your little boy sweatpants off, and this is what and He's going to repay. Him. Yeah, and look, nothing. and here's the deal: like this is when He's carrying you. This is when there's one footprint in the sand. Okay, one, mm -hmm. one footprint in the puddle. Look, I appreciate yeah. it. It was, uh, it was nice. It was um, a nice Thank try. Thank you, God. But it didn't get me. Okay. Hey guys, and this Perfect. has been another episode of <laughs> This Is This Is, is Important. Important. Wow.